Now we'll practice words that have released T and D in them. We'll make as many words as possible by combining the initial consonants and vowels we learned in lesson 2 with the final consonants T and D that we've just talked about. So in the leftmost column, we have the following initial consonants. For vowel, let's start with the identical vowel A uh, and go with T as the final consonant. Then we have the following combinations of phonemic symbols. And of all these possible phonemic combinations, the ones that are actual words are the following. Mutt, nut, hut, tut, cut, gut, put, but. Same pronunciation. Be wary of U insertion. Use proper form. And keep in mind, vowel length varies with the following consonant. Repeat after me as I say the words. Mutt, nut, hut, tut, cut. Gut, put, but. Let's change just the final consonant to D. Then we have the following words. Mud, cod, pod, bud. Again, be careful of U insertion. Use proper form. Make the vowels longer with D than with T. Mud, cod, pod, bud. Vowel E with final T and D. Met, net, let, set, get, pet, bet, ed, ned, head, led, said, ted, dead, bed. Vowel A with final T. Eight, mate, nate. Hate, late, date, Kate, gate, bait. Vowel A with D. Aid, made, laid, paid. Vowel I with T and D. Might, night, height, light, sight, tight, kite. Bite, eyed, hide, lied, sighed, tied, died, guide. O with T and D. Oat, note, coat, goat, boat, ode, mode, node, load, sewed, toad, code. Goad, bowed. Bow ow with TND. Out, doubt, pout, bout. Loud, bowed. Bow oi with TND. No final T words. Lloyd, coid, 